Hello, welcome back to the channel. My name is Mahesh Karya. You guys are watching me on YouTube now and in this session, I'm going to walk you through how to use AI models, fine tune name on your local system. And this is Olama. I'm using this for the very first time and this is better than most of other models. This is by Meta and uh, all you have to do is just download it. There are a bunch of models that are uh, working uh, way more faster than I expected on the local system. So hosting on the local system is not a good idea it takes a bunch of resources but there are lighter versions of this llama 3.2 are available now and it's faster let's try this out so i have downloaded this already this is working you can see this little icon once you download this and after that all you have to do is open your terminal quickly and uh, here is my terminal hit this command if you wanted to see the or explore the models you can go in here and uh, here is 3.2 the most latest one is available in here you can have uh, explore the other models as well as per your choice it's all your choice so it comes with 3 billion and 2 billion parameter size is just 2 gigs of size which is pretty much enough i guess not uh, making much pressure on your system but the output uh, that will get is super awesome so let's try this out all you have to do is hit this it's gonna pull bunch of things. I have already downloaded two gigs of model already with this command only. Uh, so if you are using this for the very first time, it will pick that model, install it. And after that, you will get this prompt that we are gonna use and let's try this out. So what I'm gonna do is, I'll quickly start with the hi. Hi. So how, so this is generating by the model itself. So I'll say I need next js code with app router maybe r o u t e r app router so you got this the output the way it is writing it's better than and faster than what i'm talking so of course on the local system i have the current my current system is m1 pro max m1 pro sorry and uh, i have other systems as well i've tried on the local windows as well so this is working uh great uh your application should now running on the port okay this is the part of the script and I, I can ask a bunch of other things as well if you wanted to explore more things you can have this uh, slash question mark and you will see this is help section where you can save you can save the model you can fine tune that uh, save model and deploy it uh, to hugging face or any uh, open source uh, repositories where they are taking the models and you can host on the cloudflare as well the last video that we make on the cloudflare uh, give it a try and i tried a bunch of other things as well it's not only working with uh, the next years but a bunch of other languages and a bunch of other things that you can ask please give it a try uh, there are few other techniques that you can uh, use this in a better way uh, simply go and search for the open wave you are hit enter and this is this is how it looks like so it's completely chat gpt experience on the local that you can get in here uh, just uh, go in here you have to have docker available inside your system so if you don't have it already uh, so grab this command and this command pretty much uh, enough to set up uh, i guess this this olama base url that you can provide in here and you're good to go so uh, let's try this out i'm not sure if uh, we can do it quickly so i'm gonna put it in here and hit enter and uh docker demon conflict wave ui is already there because i already ran it before so i'm gonna i have to rename this with the uh, name maybe uh, new and hit enter so you're good to go it's running port already allocated so it's running already in my inside my system if i go to here so see this is wave ui is already running so i'll go back and to here open localhost colon 3000 and you will see this is running locally so this is another tool that you can use where you can uh, select your models whatever you want okay go to the settings and install a bunch of models that you want and uh, not in here in the setting itself so it's it's running locally uh, this uh, repository is also available so you can use open web UI uh, you can clone it up you can run on your local system you can use the pip command as well if you want like this is the super cool 
uh, thing that I have found is using pip directly. So you will get this UI where you will be have flexibility to use and number of other things. You see the admin panel and bunch of other things that you can have full control on the top of that. Anyways, we are talking about the Olama in here and this is uh, the bunch of other tools that you can configure along with the Olama so or Llama or any models that you can use here and there. So the main purpose of this video is to tell you that nowadays it's easy to host any model, find on them and use on your apps as much as possible and it's not a big deal. All you have to do is get your data fine tune that and create APS quickly. So thank you so much all of you guys for being with me, supporting me all the time. It's been a pleasure to be here. Please let me know inside comment box what you want from my side. Definitely I'll make it for you and don't forget to subscribe my channel if you haven't already and smash that like button if you enjoyed. Till then see you soon. Tata. Bye bye.